very good afternoon and welcome to europe news presented by tcd chain europe so these are the headlines for today all mobiles tablets and cameras will have only common usb c charger by autumn 2024 in eu finland continues getting more support of chinese nato british prime minister boris johnson wins no confidence vote finland participates nato exercise in baltic sea Johnny Depp and Jeff Beck to perform in Finland on 19th and 20th of June. The new Facebook page for Europe News is created. Let's go to the details of this news. So all mobiles, tablets and cameras will have only common USB-C charger by autumn 2024 in EU. European Parliament have decided that all mobile phones, tablets and cameras in the EU will have the common charging port USB type C for all mobile phones, tablets and cameras in EU. European Parliament have decided that all mobile phones, tablets and cameras in the EU will have the common charging port USB type C. This would be a big impact on Apple as iPhones are charged from a lightning cable while Android based devices use USB C connectors. The laptops, e-readers, earbuds, keyboards, computer mouse and portable navigation devices are also included in this category. This would also impact on other companies such as Samsung, Huawei. However, the time period of 40 months would be provided in the case of laptops to have compiled with with this legislation. As per statement given by EU industry chief Thierry Breton, this deal could save around 250 million euro for consumers. This is great news for EU residents as they do not need to buy different chargers and it would make them easier to switch from one device to another. Another news Another news from Finland. Finland continues getting more support of joining NATO. Croatia provided a strong support to Finland joining NATO. Minister of European Affairs and Ownership is steering Tuti Tupurainen visited Croatia on Friday and got Croatia's strong support of Finland's application for joining NATO. She met Croatian State Secretary for Europe Andrea Matejko Dombik in Zagreb, the capital of Croatia. Another big news in favor of Finland also came from Canada when Canadian parliament approved Finland's NATO membership application unanimously the prime minister of Canada Justin Trudeau also wrote in Twitter Canada strongly supports Sweden and Finland's application to join NATO today in the house of commons members of parliament voted unanimously in favor of them joining the alliance next news from UK British Prime Minister Boris Johnson wins no confidence vote. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson won a no confidence vote as he got support of 211 out of 359 conservative lawmakers. The chairman of Conservative Party's parliamentary group Graham Brady announced the results and said, "I can announce that parliamentary party does have confidence in the prime minister." The confidence vote was scheduled in response to 54 conservative party lawmakers who submitted the no confidence letter to the chairman of conservative party parliamentary group. Just after the announcement of results, Boris Johnson said, "I think it is an extremely good, positive, conclusive and decisive result which enables us to move on to unite and to focus on delivery what we are going to do." With Monday's win, Johnson won't face another no confidence vote at least for a year under the rules of Conservative Party. Another big news from Finland. Finland participates not to exercise in Baltic Sea. Finland is taking part within the exercise Balto PS22 which has begun on Sunday within the Baltic Ocean and will proceed till 17th of June conquering to Finnish Guard forces. The exercise is driven by the commander of US Navy 6th Fleet. Both navy personnel and vessels from the Finnish naval force are taking part in this exercise. Finnish Air Force will moreover conduct exercise-related flight operations from Finland. Navy units in the work out incorporate vessels and teams from Coastal Fleet, the availability unit of Usima Brigade, and personnel from the Maritime Foundation. Moreover, there will be a few staff officers taking part within this exercise in different headquarters. The objective of this exercise is to create 
interoperability of the joint together states nato and accomplished nations in combined discuss and maritime operations and in land and water capable operations the workout will progress the finnish navy's participation with nato and accomplished nations in all organization levels next news from the film industry johnny depp and jeff back to perform in finland on 19th and 20th june The American actor and musician Johnny Depp is headed to Finland with amazing British guitarist Jeff Beck. They are planned to perform at occasions in Helsinki and Tampere on 19th and 20th of June. They will begin within the capital Helsinki where they will perform at the Helsinki Blues Celebration in Kaisaniemi Park on 19th June. Next day they will perform at Tampere Hall. If you know that there have been serious disputes between Johnny and ex-wife Amber Heard after 2 months of long claim fight in court jury made their decision the court ordered Johnny Depp to pay 2 million dollars to ex-wife and Amber Heard to pay 15 million dollars in damage to Johnny the last news is related to the Europe news itself the new facebook group of europe news is created the viewers are requested to join this group to get updated the latest news the link to join group is in the description box of this video this is all from europe news presented by the city chain europe i hope you received all the important information thank you for connecting with us see you in the next video have a good day